Hi everybody. Okay, so I am doing day number six for the December daily. <clears throat> and if you're not familiar, I'm doing a project lifestyle. I'm doing the six by six um, insert pages. So um, I'm not too sure how this one's going to turn out. I'm hoping it's going to turn out okay. Um, I have an idea of what I want, but um, I, I guess it's the border part that's kind of throwing me off. I want to use this Christmas tree border, and I'm, I don't know. I, I guess we'll just have to see. Um, I decided to keep my background very neutral just because there's so much going on in the picture. Um, this is a picture of my cat when we decided to pull out the Christmas tree. We could not keep him out of it, and he is... He's still a kitten, but he's big. He's like seven months old. Yeah, he was born in May. So yeah, seven months old. And um, so it was just really funny because he was bending all the branches down and everything. And we had a few of um, some like, uh, what's that called? Old like tinsel that had like these little candy cane things down and hanging down. And he was just, like batting at them. And it was a really cute picture. So all right, so I guess I'll get started. Um, I cut my tag down just a little bit so that it, um, I could leave a little bit of space for journaling. Um, my journaling has been very short for these pages um, just because there's not really a lot that I want to say. I just kind of want to document like a little bit of each day. Okay, so I'm going to be using a lot of um, Christmas tree type um pieces. All of the, the papers that I got from this and all of the embellishments are from the Scraptastic uh, December kit, which is the home for the holidays, um, minus the tag that came out of my scrap or my, my, my stash stuff. Okay, so I'm going to put the tag down first this time because I, I had so far I've been forgetting every time and I end up having to pull um, most of the, the picture and stuff up in order to do that. So let me get that down. Um, this is going to be the last one that I'm doing for the night because I have to get more pictures printed off. Oh, hi, Gus. He's in here visiting me. You must know that I'm doing um, a video or a layout of him. Hey, kitty, kitty. Okay, I want that probably about right there. Let's see how that work works. I want this to kind of be over in the corner just to kind of cover that. And then my journaling is just going to be like Gus in the tree. Um, really short, very sweet, real quick. Oh, you know what? I already messed up. See? Oh my goodness. Um, I want this Christmas tree to be back behind that actually. So it is peeking out behind the, the tag. So let me see if I can do this. I want it about right there. Is that about right? Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to put a little bit more adhesive on the back of the tree. So I know I was going to mess up somewhere every time. <sighs> All right, and now I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to go ahead and stick the picture down and it shouldn't be too hard for me to, to um, stick this little tag back behind it. So all I did was um, mat this on just some red paper. I thought I would keep it really simple. Um, just because I don't want to overwhelm the page too much. And these are um, the little vellum pieces that came out of the kit. They are... Um, There was like 136 pieces in the in the kit, and I just love them. They're awesome. You probably heard me say that a million times if you're actually watching a lot of the videos. Okay, so that is all I'm going to do for the upper part, I think, so far. And then I also want to use this tree down here. So I'm doing a lot of the trees just because um, I don't have a lot of, I, I'm already done obviously, um, it's after Christmas taking most of my pictures. And I only have one other picture of the Christmas tree other than the kids sitting in front of it. Um, I have Gus sitting in front of the Christmas tree and all of the presents. So he is going to be in two layouts this year, which is really kind of funny because this is the first year I've had a cat in, in a long time. I mean, we are 
not too much animal people, um, but I adore him. He is perfect for our family. Absolutely perfect. So let's see here. I'm trying to decide. I think I want this to go all the way across at the bottom of the picture. And I want to try to get all of the Christmas trees in. There we go. Okay, so now I'm just going to cut. I'm going to flip this over and just cut the back. I might be out of frame, but I'm trying to. Let's see here. Uh, I'm gonna try to do it as straight as I can. I, I am out of frame. All I'm doing is just cutting the, the trim off right there. Okay. So that is what it's looking like so far. That's actually a lot cuter than I was thinking. So that's that's good. And then I'm going to put this large tree right here. And I don't want to cover too much of him up, but it is a double, double picture, so it won't be too bad. And I think I'm just going to have to cut just a little bit of this off right here because it is going to have to fit in my 6x6 um, six six pocketed page. Ugh, stickers stuck to my desk. Okay. Let me see. There had to have been more. Um, oh, you know, I just wanted to put Naughty. I got these. Um, these are by Fancy Pants Designs. Come here, kitty, kitty. These are by Fancy Pants Designs, and this one here says Naughty, and he was being naughty, so I wanted to make sure and put that one on there. And I don't know where. Let's see here. I'm wondering if I should... Oh, where do I want to put it? I think I'm going to put it like right here by the six. No. Where do I want to stick this? See, I wasn't fully prepared, I guess. Um, where do I want to stick this? I, I think I'll just... No, I don't want to do that either. Yeah, I'll just stick this like right here. I think that works. Okay, and then I'm just going to put my journaling right there. And that's going to be it. That is um, day number six. So thanks for watching. Bye.